And six persons have been arrested after the CEO of a jute mill in Bengal was beaten to death by employees demanding an increase in weekly working hours that would have allowed them more pay. The chief minister has alleged the involvement of the BJP and CPIM affiliated trade union members in the attack, something they deny. Meanwhile, industry has been badly shaken up and the family of the 60-year-old CEO can't believe that he left for work and will never be returning home. A shell shocked Sunita Maheshwari cannot believe that her husband is dead. 60 year old Hari Kusum Maheshwari, the CEO of North Brook Jute Mill in Hooghly, had called a meeting with mill workers on Sunday evening. The mill was grappling with a strange problem, producing more jute bags and jute cloth than it could sell and Maheshwari wanted mill workers to either close down operations for two weeks or work fewer days in the week. With workers furious at the prospect of reduced wages, a heated exchange followed. A brick was hurled at Maheshwari and in the melee that followed, workers hit the CEO on the head with iron rods and he died while being taken to hospital. The general manager and the security in charge were injured. But politics over the violence is already hotting up. Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee is blaming the opposition. In a statement posted on the Trinamool website, she said, I heard that members of the unions of CPIM and BJP assembled at the jute mill with their demands and CEO HK Maheshwari came out to hear them when he was beaten up mercilessly. On the way to the hospital, he succumbed to his injuries. The BJP hit back. Mamta Banerjee is blaming the BJP and other political parties without introspecting what is the condition of law and order? It's totally collapsed. Work at the mill has now been suspended and the police is keeping a vigil. An NDTV bureau report.